Hello guys and girls, I'm Lorenzo from Voltage and in this video I'll be showing you how to verify your Nostr account with NIP5 using Voltage's Nostr Toolkit and also how to create a lightning address so you can receive zaps in your own node. The cool thing about NIP5 is that people can find you on Nostr using something like Lorenzo at vlt.ge this is way easier than having to copy any pubs around. People will just type your address and they will find you. So for instance, Bobby has his, Graham has his, and I also have one set up. So you can find me typing this on your Nostra client. You won't need my NPUB. So the first thing you wanna do is go to app.voltage dot cloud slash Nostr and log in or create a new Voltage account if you don't have one yet. Okay, from here we can set up everything that we'll need. If you want a Nostr account, you can simply paste your NPUB over here and choose your name. That's what people will use to reach you. If you don't own an account, don't worry, you can click on create new NPUB and we'll have one created for you. Just remember to store your private key somewhere safe. So here we are in the main dashboard. Here you can see some details about your account. You can also delete this Nostra account from Voltage. You can access some resources about Nostr if you're not familiar with it. And here we have the cherry on the cake. Here's where you can set up your lightning address so you can receive zaps directly to your lightning node. Actually, people can pay you from any wallet that supports lightning address. This is not only for zaps. So just click on enable and if you have a voltage node, simply enter your password. Otherwise, if you have a self-hosted node, you can click here and paste your node's endpoint, invoice macaroon and TLS cert. For the lightning endpoint, this will be the API endpoint that external services use to communicate with your node. An easy way to find this value is by searching for it in a wallet or node manager that you have connected to your node. For instance, if you're running Zeus, uh, you can open up the settings and find the value there. You also need a lightning macaroon with permissions to create new invoices. You can use LND's CLI tool to create this macaroon. Just type the command displayed on the screen into your terminal and copy the output into this field. The TLS cert you can find in LND's default working directory. This is uh, usually stored in your home directory at .lnd slash tls cert. The certificate is stored in the PEM format, so you'll need to convert to the hex format before pasting the value here. To do that, you can simply use an online text to hex conversion tool, or you can simply type this command on your terminal. Since I own a Voltage node, I'll just type my password over here and click on Save Settings. And that's it. Now people can use this Lightning address to pay directly to my node. If I open up another wallet like, like, like Albi, I can type in my Lightning address and I can pay myself. You can take a look on Thunderhub and check that the payment actually went through. I know that Bobby already has his Lightning address set up, so I can pay him from Thunderhub. I will just send the classic 21 sets. And that's it. Thank you for watching and don't forget to share your NIP5 and Lightning address with me over Nostr so we can zap around. See you guys there.